Hey, one to this. So, the Nintendo Wii U. This thing is grey. I need a light for this because you can't see anything in here. So, SD card. Nice. Two USB ports. Nice. On the Wii, the only USB ports are on the back. See these two USB ports? Well, now we have USB ports on the front as well. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. And also, it's just a lot better than a Wii. Just the hardware is a lot better. And today, we are going to be installing Linux on it. More specifically, Debian. So, yeah, without further ado, let's um, turn on everything and get started. All right, here we go. We are on the capture PC, actually. So, um, I don't know where I put that USB stick. Oh, it's already in there. And it's freshly formatted as well. Look at that. Fresh expand partition, I'm assuming. So, SD card goes in. We need the SD card. Now, my Wii U is already homebrewed, so, yeah. So, we need a firmware.image file. Here's something I prepared earlier. We can just drag that to the root. And we need a kernel image. Here's something I prepared earlier. I don't even think this is the kernel image. This is a image. We need the other image. Well, this is something I prepared earlier. There we go. Now, for the thing that I haven't prepared earlier, that USB stick. I didn't prepare it. So I need to prepare it. So we need to unzip this XZ archive. Here's something I prepared earlier. Open. Why is it always the one I'm filming? I have the worst. Oh, there we go. I was just having trouble picking what to what to flash it to. I put the SD card back in the Wii U, by the way. So we have the F drive, and we're going to flash. This is actually really easy to get it up and running. And if you want to do this for yourself, um, go into, um, where's the website? This is the website right here. I'll leave a link in the, um, I'll leave a link in the description. So, um, so you can try this yourself if you want to. Anyway, we are flashing the two point something gigabyte image to the USB stick. So let's just um, start a time lapse while that goes. Okay, sorry, I just got pinged, but there we go, flash completed. So find the USB stick, rip it out. Oh my gosh! <sighs> is a hot USB stick oh my gosh okay it's in the Wii U I don't have to touch it anymore so it said on the guide to go to the, the scene yes I know there's no disc in the drive okay well I'm holding the B button oh here we go here we go here we go here we go um ch please choose your payload firmware image loader a it's pink. Wii U menu. Huh? Oh! Whoa! 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 Oh! We're, we're doing it! We're actually doing it! I don't have any internet access though, I just realised. Do I have a... System time before build time. Advancing clock. Um, welcome to Debian GNU Linux Trixie slash Sid. Well, this is Sid. Host name set to Wii U. So I'm going to let it do its thing. I can... Oh, okay, here we go. Um, this is probably going to take a while because it's the first boot and it's running off of a, um, a USB 2.0 thing. So I'm going to let it do its thing. Okay, we're on a login prompt. So the user was Wii U. Then the password when it asks me is, um, what is it? P 
password with a capital on P. Also, if you want to try any of this at home, the link is down below into the in the description to where I um to where I found this. Oh, we got Neo Thatch. Um, Linux Wii U 4.9 4 4.19. Gosh, that's an old kernel. Anyway, um, Wii U. That is not the current date and time. I need to fix that. Thursday, September 19th. No, it's Monday, October 1st. And it's not um, 3.35 in the morning right now. It's actually um, 6.54 in the evening UTC time as of filming. Um, are you sure you want to remember? No, I don't. So, yeah, architecture, power PC, CPU op mode, 32 bit, big endian, one CPU, espresso. Yeah, I'm just, um. We got Linux up and running. Um, last login from 164 on PTS0. Oh, so someone SSH'd into this back when it was, um. Back when it was compiled. So. Speaking of SSH, actually, I can't SSH in or out of this because if I go SSH rail PC, it'll just say no. Temporary failure in name resolution. Well, the Wi Fi doesn't work, or at least I don't think the Wi Fi works. Let me see if the, if the Wi Fi works. Um, we you Wi Fi Linux. Okay, I just got another idea. I can use my phone. Can use my phone. Enable USB tethering on my phone. Um, and just share the Wi-Fi and everything. USB tethering. And then hook it up to the um to the Wii U. That is actually a good idea. I'm I'm doing that. Well, I'm gonna unplug the keyboard. Oh, I unplugged. Yes, I know. I unplugged the USB keyboard. I will re-plug it back in in a second. Gosh, get in! New high-speed USB device. Um, yes. Share your phone's internet. Oh, whoa, whoa! Whoa! Um, ping. Um, ping. Oh, I forgot. I disconnected the keyboard. I need to reconnect it. And the USB ports on the back. I will hook it up. Hook it up to this one. Oh. Okay, we have a um. Ping Google. <gasps> oh my gosh, yes! I am actually um kind of surprised that worked. So set up now, my phone is now giving it internet. It worked! Oh, yes! Okay, I'm now gonna reboot. Reboot. Oh, it's actually rebooting, okay. Oh, hey, it already comes with Apache. Somebody said that I should, um, I should just brag, just make a HTML page about bragging about that this has been run on a Wii U. Well, I've done it on a Chromebook. Why not do it on a Wii U? Well, this is taking forever. Unmounting. Okay. Um. Come on. Log in. Yes! And now we have a ton of um upgraded packages. Clear. Clear the screen, please. Yes! 
Yes, there we go. So now I believe we can run sudo app install xfc4. I just want to get some sort of um GUI or wrong password. I typed an A. Um, there we go, that's the correct password. I want to get some sort of GUI on here. Oh no. I just realised it's going to take forever over this slow internet connection, so um... Well I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did leave a like, if you have something to say leave a comment and if you want to see more then subscribe and I'll see you in my next upload.